Lots of excitement. Her friendship with Kelly dates back to her time appearing on All My Children. Currently, she stars as super spy Anna Devane on Daytime's General Hospital, a role she created how many years ago? Almost 40. <laughs> Please welcome Manola <laughs> Hughes. See you again. Oh, nice to see you. We get to hug this time. We started hearing about your weekend. Nice. Oh yes, Kelly. we, we had a rip roaring weekend. I, yeah. I dazzled her with knitting. Yeah, we stayed in the whole weekend. What, what did you guys talk about while you were knitting together? I have no idea. We talked for 48 hours or 72, or however many hours there are in a weekend. We yeah, <laughs> it was all the hours in the weekend. All we did was talk. Yes. If you look at that video, because she, you showed it to me. Yeah. Our mouths don't actually stop moving. Right, I, right. I mean, you know, right? And they're moving at the same time. Did either one of us listen? No, <laughs> no, that's not part of the deal. So what Can are you, you talking about? Take us back to when you two first met. Like, do you, oh, what was your yeah. first memory of Kelly? I accosted her. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not hallway. surprised. I did. I accosted yeah. her. I was her biggest fan, and I still am. I'm still your biggest fan. I'm your biggest fan, so well, don't. You're I, like, we can f I'll fight you for it. No, but it's, I, I literally recited a line to her yeah. from a movie she started. A monologue. A monologue. Wow. You, you knew the entire monologue, and you're walking towards me saying the lines, and I I have no idea what you're talking about until you say, it's staying alive, right? Were you frightened? Or were you? Oh, of course. Yeah. I was yeah. wary. Yeah. I was wary. Let's yeah. just say yeah. wary. <laughs> because she, of course, did not commit her persona in this movie to memory no. the way I did. Of course. No, no, no. Well, no you seem fan. to really understand the character. Because <laughs> <laughs> I clearly didn't. And knitting, you find it relaxing? Is it challenging? Yes. She said, you're you know, pro. I find it both, actually. I think it's relaxing, and it also keeps your mind very alert. Mm -hmm. And it's, we were saying it's... Mm -hmm. it's one of the number one things that you can do at practice for your, your mind body. It's like yeah. really. Is there math involved? Her, yeah. With her knitting, Yours there is, is math, math involved. Okay. Yeah, there is. But, uh, you know, you have to, I have to count and I have a counter because I can't actually do math because when I was 13, <laughs> my math teacher, he knelt in front of my desk and he said to me, um, You're unteachable, Finola. You need to go and learn French. So I can speak French, but I, <laughs> I'll, you know, I can't actually. But you add. have it, but you have, I have a counter. counter and yeah. that adds. I, I, I'm actually probably not like doing myself any good by knitting because I've got a counter. But. but you are, but you know, here's the thing you can go back to that math teacher and say, I'm a professor. At oh. USC. Woo! So, <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I mean, that's got to feel good. Yes, but it's not in math. What are you teaching at USC? <laughs> I'm teaching performance for camera because I'm hoping maybe I can learn something. <laughs> um, yeah, it's, it's, uh, it, um, it's third grade uh, MFA students and we have a performance for camera class and honestly it's been the most incredible thing that I've ever done. I'm just so enjoying it and I, I love my students. I love watching you talk about it. We were talking about it a lot at the knitting table. Um, your face lights up yeah. when you talk about your students. I love them and and it's just so beautiful like you know just we do a lot of scenes and then we, we also have this film initiative that we've been doing where we we help them write their own scripts mm -hmm. and uh, and then make the, a movie and this year we did so well we did seven short films that wow. um, Stacy Smith Dr. Stacy Smith gave us a grant so we have oh, a huge a grant for next year from the Annenberg that's what, so what are the students most curious about what do they ask you about when they meet you in person what it's like on set and and so I think part of in general or general hospital yeah no 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 like a film set. like a film set you know, um, I mean, General Hospital is shot differently. We, sh we have three or four cameras like you do yeah. and, and moving on pedestal cameras. Uh, but a film set obviously is one or mm -hmm. two cameras. And so I just like to talk about what might happen if, you know, if they're if they go to a movie that's been shooting for three months and they're playing the sort of guest role and they have to be so emotionally ready and available and what that would be like stepping onto a set with a lot of people that know each other. That How does there. that feel? Right. Yeah. You know? And so we sort of discuss that. And it's I, intimidating, I would imagine. You know, completely sure. intimidating. I mean, yes. I mean, I've shut down and I've gone and, you know, I had to, I, I did LA Law once with them. Um, Jimmy Smith and I had to step off an elevator and I was supposed to be crying and I was like oh I'm just wearing dark glasses because nothing, <laughs> <laughs> nothing I was like, it's, you know not even an ice cube is coming out <laughs> what about uh, you know you've you've directed a lot yeah and um, about to direct some more too yeah I'm, I'm that's back. so exciting yeah um but that is a math brain. I mean, you have to have a math There's calculation brain. Involved you have to in keep track of everything when you're directing. I don't see it as math, though. I mean, I, I mean, but 
thank you. I'm going to take it. <laughs> but it's like, it's like this sort of, it's like a puzzle, I suppose, yeah. you know, in a way. And, and, you know, I get to tell everybody what to do, which is, as you know, perfect. Yeah, perfect for you. <laughs> yeah. Now, um, we have to take a commercial break, but we're going to talk about General Hospital when we return. Yeah. Is that okay? Yeah. Yeah. Right Isn't it time for you to get all dressed up for the party tonight? Yes, it is, and I haven't decided what I'm going to wear yet. You looked awfully pretty in that dress when you went dancing with Buzz that night. I did? Maybe mm -hmm. I should wear that dress then. Well, you could save that one for another date with Buzz, and you can wear something else pretty tonight. All right. If that's the way you feel, I won't wear that dress. from General uh -huh. Hospital back in 1986 uh, when you were British. I was... <laughs> <laughs> I heard it there, yes. No, I'm just kidding. But I was, I was British then. And, and now? And now, I'm sort of Joan Collins transatlantic, I think. It's like, I don't know. But when you see your, wait, when you see your brother, does he say you sound American? He won't talk to me for the first, like, you know, 20 minutes that I come into his house. He's like, I, I'm not going to speak to you until you start speaking properly. And I'm like, okay. But yeah, no, I mean, I've been here longer than I was in England, really. Yeah. I mean, you know. It's I, amazing. I, yeah. I've got to tell you, though, you know, you've been on that show for almost 40 years. Uh, Don't keep saying that. I know. Not I, that. <laughs> I, was, I was going to say, you, you know, I was... You got lucky. She was going to say all 60 years. I was going to say you were there the all show. 60 years. <laughs> um, but you have consistently been always the best actress, oh. not only on that show, but on any show you're on. That's, you are just an incredibly talented actress. That's so nice. Thank you. And it's like a privilege to watch you. And and I got to act with you, which was like no. a dream come true. Well, likewise. Uh, no, no, no. Yes, no. But um, the nurse's ball is finally returning yes. after a three-year hiatus. Yeah. Well, because because after COVID, you know, we couldn't have that many people in, in right. a small space. And... Yeah. Um, so we are coming back, and it's a, a fictitious HIV AIDS fundraiser, mm -hmm. and it's just wonderful because everybody gets to dance and sing and do all the things that we latently do in, in our dressing rooms. Yeah. And, um, uh, and uh, you know, this year I'm in a safe house, though, because you know, I've, I'm escaping right, right. from being murdered. Um, and um, But... We're going to kick off the whole, you know, 60th anniversary with uh, a tribute to our beautiful Sonia Eddy, who passed mm. away. And we're doing that on March 29th. It's, it's really lovely, and a lot of great people are coming back to, to, to honor her. That was shocking and really it sad. Was so, and she was yeah. the loveliest person yeah. and, and yeah, gave yeah. the best hugs ever. Oh, yeah. yeah. She was a hugger. It's good to know. Yeah. And um, and then we're going to slowly sort of ratchet it up to the uh, to the nurse's ball. And then I think that's when all of our celebrations for the 60th start. I can't believe it's been 60 that is years. It's quite extraordinary, isn't yeah. it? It's quite a milestone for a show to have been on the air 60 years. Yeah. To be in your homes five days a week. Every and day. And to still be... No, it's remarkable. Reson you know, know, resonate know. with an audience. We you know? talk about rush home to watch General Hospital. It was like an active, you had your, what was your snack? I had uh, nachos on a cookie sheet with Tostito chips and cheddar cheese shredded. Yeah. I love that. Mm, yeah. Was it melted, the cheddar oh, cheese? Oh, it was melted. Actually, I broiled it at the end so it bubbled. That's great. And you did this? Oh, I did. When you uh, were younger? Yes. You could do all of that? Yes. Pretty impressive. Can, can I it? introduce you? Can I, I'd like to introduce you to my middle son. No, he's, <laughs> since, he's since forgotten how. Oh, trust me. Okay. <laughs> But we'd rush home to watch, and uh, it's amazing to think about, like you said, a show that's been on the air for so long, such great history, and a great yeah. tribute, and the Nurses' Ball coming up, ABC's General Hospital celebrating 60th anniversary, <laughs> April 3rd. Check out the Nurses' Ball. Good to see you. Thanks for hanging with her and hanging with us. <laughs> Thank you for having me. Coming up next, a performance by the new Menudo right after this.